Okay, class. Alright, so today we will continue to solve for log equation. Alright, so this type of question, so we have upside down base and the value of the log here. So we have 3x and here x3. Okay, so what we we do now is to change, right, to the base of 3. We will choose a number like, instead of x, right. So we will change this one, right, change to base 3. Okay, right. Okay, so the first one you have to change. So we ha we have log of x to the base of three minus four log of three to the base of three over log of x to the base of three, right? Plus three equals to zero, right? So the next step. Okay, so we are going to let this one and this one in terms of u. So, we are, we are using substitution, right? So, we let y equals to log x to the base of 3, right? So, we have here y minus 4 over y plus 3 equals to 0. Okay, so we are trying to get a quadratic equation here, alright. So, uh, we multiply every term here with y. So, we have y squared minus 4 plus 3y equals to 0, alright. So, by factorizing the quadratic equation, so we will have y minus 1 times y plus 4 equals to 0, Right, so therefore we have y equals to 1 and also y equals to negative 4. Right, but remember class, we have to change it to the base uh, uh, to log. Right, okay, so we have to change it here. Right, okay, so now I will have y equals to 1 and also y equals to negative 4. So, therefore, we change it back because we are finding for the value of x. So, we have log of x to the base of 3 equals to 1. So, therefore, we have x equals to 3 to the power of 1 by changing it to index form. Same thing goes here. So, we have log of x to the base of 3 equals to negative 4. So, we have x equals to 3 to the power of negative 4. Right? So, we're changing back to index form right right okay so therefore we have to check first class all right whether it satisfies the original equation or not all right so you have to substitute this value in this value into the original one okay so by checking so after checking all right so i have here my left hand side equals to my right hand side Right, okay, same thing goes here. I check so by substituting into the original one, right? So I have left hand side equals to the right hand side. So, therefore, the final answer will be x equals to 3, and also so x equals to 3 to the power of negative 4 is actually equivalent to 1 over 81, right? Since it's actually 1 over 3 to the power of 4. So, we have here 1 over 81. Alright, so this is the final answer. Thank you.